Bro, I don't really know how valuable this video is going to be, but I'm going to upload it anyway. And you've probably seen the title, My YouTube Channel is Failing. I mean, technically it's not. I'm still gaining subscribers on a daily basis, but honestly, bro, it's nowhere near where I want it to be, especially in terms of long-term, long-form content. Right now, I'm not, I'm not even hitting anywhere near the views that I was hitting this time last year. And again, it's, it's not all about views, and I'm not saying that. You know, I'm, I'm only doing this solely for views. But to get like 200 views on a video when you've got like 13,000 subscribers isn't ideal. And I honestly just feel like there's a big disconnect between me, the content creator, and the viewers. The people who have actually subscribed to my channel. And this is 100% my fault. I'm not playing victim here. I haven't been uploading as much. The content hasn't been good, honestly. The the videos, the, the titles, the thumbnails, they've all been a bit inconsistent and I also just think there's a big disconnect between like the self-improvement space on YouTube and the viewers of it right now you know you've got Hamza he doesn't really upload anything like he used to you know all of his videos are just to promote his online business which is fair enough you know I'm not judging but there's nobody out there really right now who I would look at and think yeah I really want to watch his videos I really want to watch those self-improvement videos. So naturally, I wanna step up and be that guy. But again, a lot needs to change with my content, with my channel. And honestly, I just need to fucking start putting in some more effort, essentially, which is exactly what I'm gonna do. Now you might have seen that I've been uploading a lot of shorts on this channel recently, and they've been doing you know, really well to help grow the channel. And I make those videos anyway, because I upload them to TikTok, because I make a decent amount of money on TikTok right now. So it just makes sense. But I also want to have good, long form content on this channel and the videos that i'm going to upload from now on i'm not going to have any crazy edits the thumbnails are literally just going to be a picture of me because i want to try and bring back a level of that authenticity that we've kind of lost you know the videos that really helped me when i was getting into self-improvement were hamza's videos when he was like essentially his unfiltered channel when he didn't really he didn't have any edited videos on there it was literally just him talking to a camera about his experiences and about you know, just him giving out advice on an authentic level. You could tell he wasn't really doing it for views, but yet at the same time, he was getting a crazy amount of views because it was something different. You know, you look at the likes of Sam Sulek, who's out there right now making like unedited videos, raw videos, no crazy thumbnails, and people love it. It's just pure authenticity. It's just him and a camera working out, and it's fresh, bro. It's something different. He's not trying to fucking keep you engaged with these crazy edits. He's not making these crazy thumbnails to try and get millions of views. And honestly, that's kind of the path that I want this channel to take. And if that means, you know, I get less views on the videos, then so be it. In my heart of hearts, I know this is the right thing to do moving forward. Now, yes, I'm still going to upload short form content because again, it helps grow the channel and I make the videos anyway. But I'm going to start uploading more long form videos like this, more authentic videos, videos that actually bring some sort of value to your life. Not just those clickbaity type of videos are, you know, the top seven ways to, to, text, to text girls. Although those videos probably would get more views, there's just something about it, bro, and I can't put my finger on it that it just, I just don't, I just don't like it anymore. I think someone just needs to bring back that authentic human connection to self-improvement content on YouTube again. And that's exactly what I'm going to try and do moving forward. So if you are new to this channel and somehow you're watching this video and that sounds like something that you're interested in, then come and be a part of the process, be a part of the movement. Let's bring self-improvement back to self-improvement content. I think I'm gonna leave that one there, bro. I appreciate you if you watch to the end again. Not a lot of value, but maybe you could take something away from this. In fact, no, there is something I want you to take away from this, bro. This isn't an act of desperation to try and grow the channel. It's an act of trying to gain back consistency. And if you're in a place in life where you're stuck or you know, you're struggling to overcome a hurdle or you're struggling to move forward, to bring back consistency is probably the best possible move on the chessboard at that point. When you do something in an act of desperation, it doesn't lead you to the final outcome that you want. If anything, it probably makes it worse and it takes you a step further away from that end goal. Consistency is always king, bro. Let me leave you with that. I appreciate you if you watch to the end. Like the video, drop a comment, share it. Help me out with the algorithm, all of that good stuff, bro. I'm making it my mission to help turn boys into men.